Hey y'all, welcome back to my channel. Hey y'all, welcome back to my channel. This is Beauty with Kat. So today I'm here to give you guys another wig review slash lookbook. This lookbook was actually inspired by Kyra Shawn. She had did a Bobby Boss lookbook, and y'all, Mama served. Okay, make sure you guys are checking out her lookbook video as well. So let's get started. This is their Bobby Boss Boss Lace First Class Hair. This is Indie Style MLF 460 Electa. She is in the color TD1B30. And there's her stock card. Come on. There we go. There's her stock card right there. She does have a 3.5 deep lace part. She is an ear to ear lace. She comes with special tie dye colors. She is a hand tie lace front and she does have natural baby hairs. And of course, all of these wigs can withstand heat up to 350 to 400 degrees. So like I said, this is Electa. Okay, y'all see that, y'all see that, okay. So the next one is Miss Susie. Miss Susie looks fire. She does come with the same description, except she does have a 4.5 deep lace parting space. So remember, Electa has a 3.5, and Miss Susie has a 4.5. She comes in the color THL 1B2730. This next wig, she is in the style MLF 429 Yulia. She is in the color TT2 FGBLD. And she has a five inch deep lace parting space. So those are the three wigs that I will be reviewing and putting them on so y'all can kind of check out to see if y'all like how they look, how they will feel. I feel like these colors are very perfect for the fall. In the end, I will be giving you guys my pros and cons for each wig, so make sure you guys stay tuned. Again, thank y'all so much for coming back to my channel. I really appreciate y'all. Stay tuned for this lookbook. Let's get started. Hey y'all, so let's get started. So of course I will be <laughs> going through each wig and actually giving you guys um, the pros and cons, how it's made. So all three of the wigs, they all come with a brown tinted lace. It's not too dark brown, but it is brown and they're all middle part lace fronts. They all have three combs, two on the side, one in the back and adjustable straps. And yeah, the construction all across the board are very, very similar. So even though all of the internal factors of this wig is similar, the actual hairlines for each wig was actually different. Electa, as you can see, was more of a less plucked lace front. When it comes to Electa, her hairline did need it to be plucked a little bit, but that was okay because what you're really trying to just focus on is the middle like four un four inches four inches of the wig and honestly that's probably why you see the baby hairs where they're positioned anyway so you can have that leeway of just plucking that section of the hair so Electa did have a very basic hairline so if you did want to go back and repluck her you can Yulia kind of the same thing but not as bad as Electa and Susie actually had a beautiful hairline like you didn't have to pluck her but again the price points are different Again, like I said, the only difference with these wigs is the part and space length. They're all different. So let's jump straight into the pros and cons with all three of these wigs. So the pros across the board for all three of the wigs, the colors. The colors are gorgeous, 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 gorgeous. Bobby Boss do not miss when it comes down to the colorways of their wigs. 
easy application the laces were blendable the cap was very lightweight so you wouldn't have to worry about you getting hot under these wigs these wigs are actually perfect for like hair hat wigs so if you got a cute little fedora or a cute little scully or a cute little cap that you just want to throw on with these wigs this is perfect now the cons with all three of these wigs all three of them was shiny why were they so shiny dude like i was really shocked when i seen like the stock card and then when i pulled it out i'm like what is this but even though the wigs are easy to apply they all looked very very wiggy i was not feeling not feeling the texture was not feeling how shiny these wigs were electa and yulia's density was very light and the hair was very thin electa especially like it really felt like she had like one to one and a half like bundles on this wig cap you know she had a cute colorway and she was just very sleek she could have been a little bit more thicker or the texture just could have been different the textures of electa and yulia was very silky it could have been a little bit more kinkier however susie was a fuller density than the other two but all three of them all three of them tangled really really bad really bad and they all shed a lot a lot and the thing <laughs> It's crazy because my fave was Susie and I was able to wear her the next day. Child, what? Baby, kept brushing that thing. It's so crazy because Susie's texture was totally different than the other two. It wasn't as silky and it had like almost like a kinky texture a little bit, but she was shiny, but she tangled up so bad y'all. I was so disappointed. Even though Yulia was a middle part wig, I did put her to the side. I didn't like how she looked on the front. I really love this side action that she's giving. At this point, I'm sorry. There's no excuse on why the texture of certain wigs are coming out trash at this point. I understand the price point is very affordable. This is not human hair. So I understand synthetic hair is gonna do what synthetic hair do, but it's like, dang. I was not expecting this hair to shed and tangle like it did, like very disappointed in that. For the price points, these wigs are great to experience, but the headache of the maintenance of it is too much, y'all. It really, truly is. So that concludes today's video. Thank y'all so much for coming back to my channel. I hope you guys got the information that you needed off of this lookbook. Everything about these wigs will be in my description box below. The product link, the description of it, all that other good stuff. So make sure you guys are reading that. Thank y'all so much for coming back to my channel. I appreciate y'all every single time. And I'll talk to y'all later. Peace.